hi everyone welcome back to the channel um this is just a quick update on how to use unrect so as probably many of you are aware already um eel robot has been another project that has just rugged in the past the time of this video five minutes ago so if you if you don't follow a similar procedure what i do when i'm allowing uh contracts to interact with my wallet um you need to do this so i do it anyway just to be doubly safe pretty much so if you come to the app the onrec.net i leave a link in the description if you go to metamask here it's linking in my wallet so as you can see here here's the contract that i've interacted with um you can see some of these are obviously unlimited and then i have a certain amount that it's only allowed to access so if we quickly jump to the yield robot contract you can see it here we have nothing in it now um so all i'm doing is 608 is the contract it uh, address of yield robot so i jump over here 608 i revoke it so pretty much it's the whole approve section that you would have done earlier um so it's confirm again confirm it through your ledger wallet approve it is a small transaction fee for it but all this is doing is allowing that contract basically saying it's not allowed to have access to your wallet and to spend 160 even have the BUSD I know a lot of people do this and they set it to unlimited so I think even for me at the moment the unlimited here this could be prosperity gem ventures I think I'm not 100 sure and obviously pancake swap I have unlimited I know too um, so that should be this one removed 608 I just refresh it to make sure uh, you can see the 608 has gone now this is another one this was from circulate money again you can see here the max I have allowed it is 300 so if you had that if you weren't using the ledger wallet and you had this set to unlimited there's a high chance that your your wallet could have been drained could be drained of BUSD so as I said just be careful using the ledger wallet and make sure you revoke the access to it uh, revoke access straight away to all these but also when you're approving contracts do not approve more than what you uh, want to spend so if you want to spend two hundred dollars in a platform just approve the two hundred dollars don't approve unlimited spend um because it's there's no point in it so this is revoked as well so if i jump over to um uh, did we jump to no this is these are uh, these this is an example so these are gone anyway so as i had a limit to this you approve it now again do not approve this i'm just trying to show an example here so give permission so most people just ignore this and they go straight down to confirm however i always come to the edit permission and then change the custom spend limit and this is where you put in your whatever you want to spend so it pretty much means this contract can only ever spend that amount out of your wallet and i kept this open for that reason so again making sure you revoke platforms as soon as you anything like that uh, happens rugs happen but um make sure to get into the habit of only confirming a certain amount yes you waste a bit of money if you need to deposit again because you have to always approve it but i'd rather waste um 10 20 cent as opposed to losing potentially hundreds so Again, this is another contract. I have to double check what this is now to seven one, but um, it's BUSD. And I'm nearly sure it's um, Prosperity Gem Ventures. No, it's not six. E. I have to, I'll have to look up and see what that one is then. For that, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, and again, I got stung in this as well. I only claim ninety two dollars. Uh, two hundred fifty-two dollars invested in it, um, just reinforces the re changes need to come. Um, as I said, I made a video there today already. Just make sure you check it out. Um, yeah, changes need to happen within the space, and I for one will do everything I can to try and help. So that's pretty much it. Uh, how to revoke it? So make sure you do that. It's good to do this regularly to clean out your wallet and something now I'll have to look at myself doing as well. So. Yeah, that will leave it there. Thanks very much for taking the time watching it. And again, sorry if you're involved in Yield Robot.